So if you may have noticed, I'm a failure. I failed no shave November. I had a thing and I had to shave and I just, I didn't want to tell you guys because I was worried you'd get mad and beat me off. But enough about the scruff. I want you to watch this Vine video called The Struggle. It's basically two wacky, wavy, inflatable, flailing arm tube men going at it. Ah! That was the don't, last Don't let go! Don't Why let go! You I've got you! I've got you! Now <laughs> that's great, man. It's Look, it's a simple concept. You just take a funny video and add a voiceover and you get hilarious. Man, I wish these wacky, wavable, inflatable, flailing arm tube men really would fight, because it'd give me something to watch while I get my oil changed. Ah, that was the don't, last don't let go! Don't let Why go! I've got you! I've got you! I've got you. I feel like there's a story behind this, like they're fighting to win the heart of a blow-up doll. Here's a fun fact. These things are called air dancers. Here's another fun fact. I have no clue what the fuck they're actually designed to do. I mean, why the hell must they be outside of every single auto repair shop, like taunting me and shit? You know, between these things and the guys who dance around with the signs, auto shops put a lot of work into getting your attention. So would I enjoy seeing these two things fight to the death? Yeah, but only if they actually die. By the way, I have a clip from last year where I did the wacky, wavy, inflatable bit from Fan Family Guy in one take. I don't know, seems relevant. Wacky wavable inflatable arm flailing two men. Wacky wavable inflatable arm flailing two men. Wacky wavable inflatable arm flailing two men. Hi, I'm Al Harrington, President and CEO of Wacky wavable inflatable arm flailing two men warehouse and emporium. We are currently overstocked on wacky wavable inflatable arm flailing two men and we're passing the savings on to you. No, I can't really get into workout videos because their fake enthusiasm just freaking kills me. It just doesn't seem realistic. But check out this workout video from the 1980s. Clearly there was a coke problem in the 80s. I mean, look at that guy. He is riding the white pony as we speak. You know, honestly, I'd rather be morbidly obese than wear a purple onesie and work out with this much fucking fake enthusiasm. You know, no human being should be this excited while working out. It's just not natural. What if that were me? Like people like you and I, we aren't like that. You know, whenever I work out, I'm like, fuck. And then I make a face like this the whole time. Seriously, if working out had a sexual orientation, this would be the most homosexual workout video I've ever seen. Like even Richard Simmons would be like, that is some gay shit. And I'm not saying gay like a negative sense or whatever. I'm not like that. You guys know that. I'm just saying that these guys bang each other after every workout and you can't tell me otherwise. And am I crazy or does it look like they're dancing on the set of Saved by the Bell? Anyway, I can't look at this video anymore. We gotta move on. So recently YouTube changed their comment system where now you have to sign into your Google Plus account before you can actually comment. Now personally, I don't really care. I don't read comments that often and frankly, it's just YouTube, who gives a shit? But I've noticed people freaking out like, I gotta sign into Google Plus? What is this, Nazi Germany? But this guy Francis has this rant about the topic that's one of the funniest things I've ever seen. Exhausted after a really long day, I try to put up with all this new Google Plus bullshit. You know, they came out and tried to tell us that it was going to be a better commenting system, better commenting system. We're going to clean up the cesspool that is the YouTube comment section. Okay, to begin with, you're supposed to use your real name. No one's using their real name! I saw Hitler! I saw Jesus Christ! I saw, I saw Obama! It's not, unless that was really Obama and really Hitler, I don't think they're using their real fucking name! Now I have to have the Google Plus integration? Nobody wants to use Google Plus. You know what makes somebody hate a service or a website? Forcing them to use it. Not a fucking thing. I got a virus. Viruses and decks and viruses and decks and viruses and decks. Welcome to the new YouTube fucking comment section. Hope you enjoy Google fucking Plus. Now, as much as I don't want to get into this non-issue, the guy has a point. Now, I'll always have a soft spot for Google and YouTube, because as you guys know, that's where I started performing, but let's face it, Google Plus kinda sucks. In the pecking order that is social networks, Google Plus ranks below MySpace. Google Plus is like that kid that your mom would force you to hang out with when you were younger, and you were like, Mom, I don't wanna hang out with that kid. 
Like he always picks his butt and it's gross. Yeah, Google Plus is that butt picker kid. All right, I'm being a little bit mean, but all I'm saying is Google, when you force people to use Google Plus, you kind of take the social out of social networking. Now that being said, Francis also has a really good point about how it's a mistake to let people do artwork in the comments. And you added ASCII art? Yeah, people are drawing pictures of dicks. People are putting up pictures of dicks. Jesus Christ, roll, big fat dick. Are you kidding me? Oh, all my comment section is dick, 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 cock, dick, 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 cock, dick, dick. What the fuck, YouTube? Now, as brilliant as Francis is, it's actually a character created by a guy who goes by the username Boogie2988. You, you probably remember him. I've reviewed his stuff before. He's brilliant. So yeah, Boogie's playing a character called Francis, and it's really a brilliant way to get your point across. By the way, I'm playing a character. Like, this is a character right now. You know, this is not the real me. The real me is a lot more enthusiastic, like... All right, guys, that's it for Equals 3 this week. Don't forget to check out the full videos. The links are down below in the description. I'm Ray, that's Ray William, whatever, and I have crooked thumbs. Also, Riley Rewind comes out December 12th. That's in a month. I'm super nervous. You have no idea. I just want to go hide in the corner. I just, I don't know. I want to do aerobics in a purple leotard. I don't know. I'm freaking out a little bit. I'm nervous. I'm excited. Don't forget to check it out. Riley Rewind, December 12th. I'm out. Somebody not know how to flush the toilet after they've had a shit. You guys like inspirational videos, right? I mean, that's why you watch this show, because I'm such a disgrace that it inspires you to be a better person.